Also, don't forget to follow us on all our social media platforms. That is on Facebook at GBS TV. That is on Insta at GBS TV. That is also at Twitter at Kenya GBS. That is also on YouTube at GBS TV Kenya. So don't forget to follow us. Uh, also, sit back, relax, and enjoy because I'm about to take you on a new ride with the artist today on the studio. So, Waseni Yadze Niyadze. Mkufiti. 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 Kweli, kweli. Tell us who you are, maybe starting with you, what you do, na leona represent Mtagani. Okay, mimi naitua Protobi. Yeah. Uh, mimi producer, mimi badu ni artist. Yeah. I present uh, Mtaya Kawangwari. Kawangwari people, the Kawangwari massive people. Kawangwari massive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Kabisa. Yeah. Mimi naitua, naitua Dikine White. Mm -hmm. Eh, mtani Matari North. Matari North. Eh, Narep, Mwanzee Matari North. Kweli, kweli. Yeah. Matari North represented in the house, in the building. Vibaya sana. Anyway, um, so maybe t tell us a little bit about, about um, maybe what, what you do, basically, into the details. You are a producer and you are an artist. So tell us the kind of music you do and uh, a little bit about your production. Yes, uh, nafanya mziki. Ambao, I'm almost like into everything, niko versatile, yeah. kama producer. Mm. Eh, natengeneza, nafanya hip-hop, yeah. nafanya nini zook, yeah. nafanya dancehall, eh, zote, kapuka, mm. hizo genge tone zote, yeah. eh, because I'm a producer. Mm. As an artist, uh, I'm more into uh, dance, danceable, danceable beats. Mm -hmm. eh, that, that, that's what uh, I like most. Mm -hmm. Na... Isn't the video an inspiration as I an artist? I see. Yes, so, so by danceable beats, you mean uh, you you mostly you mostly do club banger type of music? Yes, I do club banger type of music. Yeah, yeah. Uh, even with the artist, I work. I work when you're not doing their work. Yeah, yeah. When you're not studio, mm -hmm. that's the kind of music I do. That is awesome. Yes, yes. Amazing. Thank you, Abukali. Amazing. Uh, Diken, yeah. tell tell us a little bit about the type of music you do, basically. Okay, I do Afro Afrobeat mm -hmm. music. Yeah. Yeah. First Nianza Nianza Nikifanya gospel. Mm. So see nikatoka nika shift gospel to secular music. Uh -huh. reasons kidogo kidogo. Now in fact that is one of the funniest <laughs> things on our today's show. Both of you I have an understanding that you started doing gospel. Yeah. Yes. And later on in the way vitu zikabadilika serikali kapinduliwa. Mhm. Mm reason kuna reason. No that is the best for you. <laughs> what nini lifanya utoke huko? Okay, okay. Ukafanya that process. Yeah. Nowadays we call that process uilipoze. That will uh, uilipoze <laughs> process. So what made you really pose? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Kitu will do. Mm -hmm. Nile nyi manzo na nda perform church. Yeah. I love pastor na kumbia. Manze umekuja dikene. Mm -hmm. Na kitu na kumbia mungu wa kubariki. Unacheki? Mm -hmm. So manze baraka zilikuwa mingi. Lakini kapata mika wa msani manze kiatu sina. <laughs> mfuko kuna. Manze mfuko ikakuwa mbaa sana. So si hati ni shift jua pesa. But yeah, yeah. nilifanya hivyo ndio. Pia mi msani nilifanya. Nilikuwa nika kufanya kitu na fin kwa comfortable na ya. Mm -hmm. Juni kianza manze nilanza nikiwa. Unajua ile kulelewa church ni nini, nini. Yeah, sasa yeah. nikafanya tu gospel but nilikuja nikajidiscover nikasema acha mm. nifanye kitu wrong inataka mm. kitu nda feel niko free nayo but, but there are also other artists from the gospel uh, industry who wako hapo na wanafanya poa na wana struggle eh? why okay, why unajua wana... unajua weka we hata wewe yeah, ukiwa yeah. hapa yeah, yeah. hii ni kazi yako unaipenda yeah. hapa ndo una feel kwa comfortable sure. bro ni kupeleka mjengo utafanya mjengo yeah, yeah, sure. hii ndio kazi yako so mimi niliona ni poa niende kwa kazi nyingine za fanya beta yeah. na tumefanya mambo okay yeah. maybe for you toby uh, <laughs> yes, yes, tell, tell us why did you shift eh hey, mimi mazee kwanza ni reason uh, mob sana uh -huh. Kadha wa kadha, eh, moja nezanza na enye my friend hame ahilaita hapa. Uh, watu wakanisa awalipi. Eh, awalipi bana. <laughs> Alafu you know like uh, history ya kusema umekuja kutubariki, utabariki wa you see. Uh, yeah. While uh, they in, the, in church wanakuambia toa. Mm. You see. So they, they should also try and uh, give you at least kupu motivate you see. Mm. So like uh, talent hata kwa Bible nasema. Talent is something ambayo itakufanya ukaina wakubwa. Mm -hmm. na, kana, th na wakubwa inamanisha there is an exchange of something. You know, you cannot just sit there when you are... You cannot sit with the wakubwa kama wea abuk, uh, abukali yeah, yeah. Uh, if you don't have anything, you know. Yeah. Lazima kuwe na kakitu kwa mfuko. Yeah, yeah. So, hiyo lazima wakua wana, wanasaidia. Kweli. At least ku, ina, ina motivate artists. Kitu ingine ambayo pia ilifanya ni katuka kwa gospel uh -huh. ni hypocrisy, you know. Uh -huh. Like... Uh, uh, 
kwa, kwa nini like uh, okay the thing is uh, unaona platform ya gospel iko yeah. but uh, imewekwa like imetengewa few people yeah, yeah. ambao ndio wanasukumwa mbele I so see. Uh, i know i'm speaking on the live to tell yeah, it. maybe yeah, it yeah. can bring controversy yeah. uh, that thing uh, unaona pia ileta shida kwa sababu uh, why not give every artist a chance you know yeah, yeah. don't don't go like hata yesu akuwa na bagua yeah, yeah. yesu akuwa na favorite at like anasema anasema huyu 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 afai kuingia kwa ufalme wa mbingu huyu huyu anafaa you see so the, all artists should be treated as the same na hiyo ndio frustration iko paka uko mashinani yeah, yeah. unapata wale the big top DJs wa gospel ambao wako pale kwa gospel yeah. what, what they do they, they have a selected team mm. they want to promote them mm. but when these other team wana leta muziki zao they feel like no we are not connected to these guys so we cannot promote these guys you see i see, I uh, see. so gospel should be ni kitu ya preach so ili ndakani kwa open to everyone okay yeah. so maybe for dikene tell us a little kitu bit kitu nasema uh, naweza sema uh, lakini hii nataka ifikie ma dj wa gospel yeah. nilitoka kwa lakini ma dj wa gospel wana ringa sana mm. sijui mbona wanafanyia mungu kazi nafa wafanyie mungu kazi mm. wafanyie mungu kazi si mi kitu nilifanya nitoke huko sana sana ni ma dj wa gospel mm. wana ringa sana ah. lakini wa secular ni wanafanya kazi poa lakini hao ma dj wa secular yeah. wani ni wa gospel bro Mm, secular guys they are more welcoming nafikiri mm. tukienda hivyo that's why even i think uh, gospel down, gospel, gospel music inaenda 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 in, 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 in chini on, on another level yes. but anyway aside from that mm. can, um, how has the industry been uh, for you so far uh, having shifted from doing gospel type of music mm. to doing <coughs> secular type of music the the gangeton type of music maybe oh Manzi since nilianza kufanya hii muziki yeah. ya hii muziki ya kidunia mm. eh mwanzi nimechekiwa sawa umenikubali wamenichukulia vizuri mm-hmm. more than hata vile walikuwa wananichukulia huko nyuma mm-hmm. juu una, unajoi kuimba secular music unatoa kwa hati yako yeah. unatoa kutoka feelings yani kitu kai hiyo mwanzi mm-hmm. unacheki yani yeah. yani matokeo yamekuwa poa mm-hmm. says so regret mm-hmm. yeah. i see i see maybe for you toby yes sir. how how has the industry been for you Uh, the industry has been very okay. Okay. Uh, na mama niseme the industry has been very okay for me man. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay, the the thing is uh, uh, the reception on the secular uh, secular side yeah. is very good man. Yeah. The reception is very good. Yeah. Gospel DJs maze mjifunze sasa sasa si watu watu ni secular DJ wajifunze from you guys. Okay. You are the one to learn from the secular DJs. Awesome, awesome. Maybe not to spike of um, controversy around the show. Uh, th- let us get into your music. So maybe when did you start doing music and uh, when did you start doing production? Okay, uh, I started doing music uh, as an artist. I started in uh, when, when I cleared my my form four. Mm-hmm. Uh, when was that? Hey, that was uh, yes, it was it was years <laughs> back. I don't know how to speak about that. But okay. it was years back yeah, yeah, yeah. when I cleared mm-hmm. and then uh, immediately um nika lazima uweze ingia kwa music direct. Nilianza yeah. kazi kwanza, uanze mm-hmm. kufanya kazi hivyo hivyo. Yeah. So nika jiingiza kwa kazi ambayo eh, naweza pia jivunia kusema nafanya. Mm-hmm. Eh, naweza sema. Yeah, 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 yeah. Eh, nafanya kazi ya kutengeneza nywele, yeah. hairdresser. Yeah. Eh naona uko na style mzuri I like that. Shukran sana, shukran sana. Yeah. So uh, nikaingia kwa hiyo and then nikijangol jangol na muziki. Yeah. So at the moment uh, as I'm speaking to you guys niliweza kufanya hiyo nikaweza kusema on the, just on the personal progress. Yes. Nikaweza ku save ni mkabai instrument za studio. Yeah. Nikaenda nikajilipia diploma in music production wow. East Africa Media Institute. So wow. I'm a learned producer wow. not just a back back do producer mwenye anajifunza from there nimeenda nimejifunza nime mm-hmm. graduate na diploma yeah. so right now na juggle between uh, hair na production, production as a producer and as an artist uh, awesome yes, well, maybe what inspired you useme i want to be a producer because most of the artists they are just artists and that's it maybe mm-hmm. on your part nini ile ile sema ile ile kupush ukasema hey this time round man i got to produce my own music Yeah, okay so the kitu nje ni push sana ni kwamba okay you feel like as an artist you have something to share to yeah. the world and you want also to be a voice of uh, mm-hmm. and a voice of change mm-hmm. so hiyo ndio ili inspire sana so the thing is uh, i was like 
hizi vitu wao wasanii wenyewe wametu inspire maybe from generation yeah. hakuna mtu mwenye ajui Michael Jackson mm -hmm. hakuna mtu mwenye ajui wakina Daudi Kabaka yeah. Uh, even nameless mm. and all these other local uh, the late isa the legendary late isa yeah hakuna mtu me ajawajua about those people so when, when when we grew up listening to uh, to them mm -hmm. we felt like we want to be like them yeah. and then when you, you go like behind them there's a label like ogopa dj and these other label is lab, labels yeah. at that moment yeah, yeah. you feel like I, I want to learn what goes on behind the scene you know mm. for for an artist to be there lazima kuwa pia na producer so it's the motivation ya barabara ambayo imenipeleka kufikia paka mahali penye nimefika kama music producer and artist yes sir okay you can uh, tell us when did you start doing music eh hey, mwanzo nilianza nikiwa primary uh -huh. na Class. Now professionally up up nilianza after form 4 after form 4 yeah. how many years so uh, karibu 4 5 so your time ukianza mm. ulikuwa na aspirations gani na muziki and what was your idea about the music industry and you come sasa kwa ground uko na what yani vitu ni different designs kwa nafikiria hivyo unajua mimi mi kitu sana ilinifanya ni 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 kwa na hiyo tamaa ya muziki ni watu nime grow now mtani kuna watu kadhaa wametoka mtaa yangu okay. na wamekuja wame make it mm -hmm. so watu nilikuwa na ni ona ni push sana yeah. niendelee kufanya muziki mm -hmm. na since nilifuata njia zao pia mm -hmm. nikona at least pia mimi na muziki nimeanza kunsongesha songesha kidogo mm -hmm. na through music mm -hmm. pia tunafanya vijana mtaani pia na yeah, yeah. badilika mm -hmm. unajua huko mtani, mtani kwetu vijana wengi wameingilia drugs mm -hmm. wengi wameingilia ugondi nini nini yeah, yeah. lakini through music ile tuna kama event mtani nimefanya yeah. vijana wakachinja alafu pia na shukuru sana hii muziki imekuja hii mm. wave ya gengeton imesaidia sana kuleta vijana pamoja mm. na imefanya pia crime punguke mtani maybe talking about that right now tunaona there, there is a shift in the music industry mm. and it it is becoming it is becoming of um, unpredictable sana sana tunacheki one day it's it's hip hop all over everyone is listening to hip hop the other day no one wants hip hop everyone is in the gangton <laughs> vibe mm. right now uh, with the with the recent incidents here king kaka releasing his track uh, which has spiked off a lot of conversations all around so maybe how do you think unona music industry in ndawapi because now we we are seeing artists coming as coming uh, in a way to to to, to say the truth and to be revolutionary yes. to do all this stuff out there to st is that another shift in the music industry or has that affected you or what is your predictions of the future in the music industry yes kwanza big up uh, king kaka yes. king kaka maze number one support eh? pro tobi na ku maze big up big up tano tano ya hewa okay and then um, Another thing also also maybe on the flip side ya King Kaka. Yeah yeah. Eh, nikiongea. Eh, amesema vizuri ametaja about uh, corruption. Yeah. But uh, as an artist amefanya kazi mzuri yeah. kabisa. Yeah. Eh, Nampea yote. Mm. But uh, na feel kuna area fulani angeguzia mm. kwa sababu kuna vitu ambazo mbili ambazo mimi mwenyewe kama Pro Tobi mm -hmm. this is my own opinion yeah. Pro Tobi. Eh, naona ya kwamba corruption iko widely spread on money laundering na land yeah, yeah. so naona ali concentrate so much on the money na akaacha side ya land mm. so hapo nimekatu question mark so maybe maybe for for artist for you as an artist yes. do we also expect you to also bring for us an a revolutionary song maybe yes yes yes, yes yes as an artist hiyo ni kama burden tunabeba ya community yeah ambapo we are the eye of the community to the world mm -hmm. so uh, if something bad happen if the government is oppresses its own people mm -hmm. the waking kaka has done which is right mm -hmm. uh, tutasimama tuta ikifika ni time ya best yangu hapa yeah. kasava ku, kuongelea about ile inafanyika kwa community we we'll yeah. do if ikifika ni time ya protobi to do it yeah. we are going to do it uh, without hesitating oh, we see yes okay maybe for you dikan Okay mimi <coughs> kitu naweza sema naweza sema King Kaka alifanya kitu poa. Yeah. Unajua naweza tumia muziki ku spread message haraka mm -hmm. sana. Mm -hmm. So mimi naona alifanya kitu ya maana sana mm -hmm. na kasi si wasanii. Pia kupitia King Kaka pia si tu learn lesson hapo. Eh hata muziki yenyewe muziki tunafanya at least kwa muziki ya kuleta message kwa watu. Maybe sh should we expect any song from you maybe next year 
enye inaongelelea kuhusu this thing okay, that unajua, unajua kwa msanii yeah. msanii kwanza ni mtu creative yeah. anytime yani ukitaka kufanya mziki juu ya njaa kama kuna ngomangu mpya inaitwa njaa mm. ukitaka kufanya juu ya mama ukitaka kufanya juu ya nini yeah. so mimi mu expect vitu mingi zitakuja mm. i see vitu mingi sana zina okay kama. okay maybe what are some of the challenges you encountered when you started music and also production Okay uh, challenges ambazo naongelea uh, okay naongelea kwa sababu inafanyika kwa massive artists yeah yeah eh uh, kiti ya kwanza ni tunaanza na support support ya familia mm -hmm. uh, support ya familia uh, na before support ya familia kwanza inaanza na wewe mm -hmm. like uh, we feel like okay i'm talented i, I do poetry mm -hmm. i do I, i write music nini mm -hmm. but uh, you start doubting yourself mm -hmm. like am i am i really seasoned for for the season yeah, yeah. Uh, should i really do this for for this season yeah, yeah. so when you just start doubting yourself kitu ya kwanza inakufanya you take time to to need to, to know yourself uh, kitu ya pili ni family family unapata kwamba when family is not supportive uh, your career will not take off at the right time yeah, yeah. so you be like uko hivi kwa sababu unaambia eh hey, mama mimi nataka kuwa msanii nataka kuwa artist anza nakwambia hii hey, kazi ya artist ni ya mahasala lazima uniambie unataka kuwa lawyer unataka kuwa nini yeah. while muziki unaona hata to the western world unapata it's a career mm. like any other career mm. Mm. so hiyo ni challenge kitu kingine ni pesa pesa mm. kwenda when you don't have this two let, let's say like we don't, don't, have, don't have a support yeah, yeah. and you're not working you are still a student mm -hmm. unapata pesa hata ya kwenda kufanya rekodi yeah. ni ngumu juu mzazi yeah. anaona ana waste pesa yake kwa mm -hmm. ati yako mm -hmm. kwanza na big up kuna parent, parent mmoja alikuja kwa studio yangu yeah. akakuja akalipia mtoto wake ili mtoto wake aweze ku record yeah. and i did the music ya huyo mtoto na huyo mtoto wake muziki yake alicheza voice of america wow. radio wow. Uh, with lali Lar 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 wow. did the in play the music live in America. Wow. So mzazi kama huyo unapata ali motivate mtoto wake. Tutaka kuona support sana. Yes, yeah. naweza kuona stars. Yeah, 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 yeah. So if if, the, if that's is, kama hiyo kitu inaweza kuwa work tone. Mm -hmm. Ukiona mtoto wako na kuna talent ya bowl ya kuna nini, anza kuwaleta mapema. Maybe to maybe to to ask uh, for you when you started music, yes. was your family there? Did they give you any support? Okay my family uh, they gave me support but it was 50-50. Okay. You know like uh, they feel like you can do something much better mm -hmm. than uh, doing music mm -hmm. but because kuna kitu kingine ambayo you cannot co you don't have control over it you yeah. know ukipata bob, ukisikia bob, bob, bob male akimba about freedom akimba about anything yeah. and then you feel like it's so strongly in you mm -hmm. you feel like you're singing along with that mm -hmm. and then you feel like ah Neza imba kama Bob Marley ama Neza imba kama mse fulani yule like Dube or any other artist. Mm -hmm. Iyo inakuwa so strong in you. Paka hata mzazi wakati maybe they are not giving you full support. Yeah. You have to find your own way of uh, yeah, yeah. supporting yourself. Yeah. Yes sir. Okay, I see. Maybe so far how has the journey been? Are they still supporting 50 50% or walilenga story? Ah, sai sai wamefua na furahia sana. Mm. Sai wana furahia kwanza familia yote wametu in GBS TV, yeah. mabeste wote wametu in GBS TV. Ah, GBS TV is the station to be. Um, so wote wa, right now I've seen 100 full support mm. uh, from uh, everyone I've met. Yeah, yeah. It's really good. Wanaambia you just forge on forge on forge on which is a really nice thing. Okay. Yes. Maybe for you uh was there support uh, from your family when you started doing music? I mean I started manzi ilikuwa ngumu. Okay. Ilikuwa ngumu sasa wazazi wetu wa Kiafrika yeah. wanaamini education ndio inaweza tu okorea mm. mtu kwa maisha yake. Mm -hmm. So ilikuwa ngumu lakini my dad alikuwa ana support mom ndo alikuwa anasema hii vitu unafanya mm. hizi ini wazimu wewe <laughs> bwacha wazimu yeah. eh sasa kwa na anakubali mziki yeah, yeah. so sasa hizi wanakubali wameona mziki pia ni kazi mm -hmm. eh pia mziki ni kazi inaweza fanya hata ulipe rent ufanye mm. nini na ujikalishe eh okay. so lakini kitu kubwa sana nilikuwa napitia nikigrow kimziki mm -hmm. mm -hmm. nile watu waezi kukubali kwa community yeah. waezi kuku kukuaminia mm -hmm. au nikapi unaweza do it mm -hmm. kufanya mziki yani waezi appreciate maybe let's talk a little <laughs> bit about that uh, mbona unafanya watu appreciating artists from mostly from their area cause mimi ni mtindo yangu every single time i start this show i really must ask an artist what mtaa you representing mm -hmm. yeah cause people from your mtaa there are people watching out there and they need to know hey that is our, our artist he comes from our place mm -hmm. eh hey, ule ni wetu ule ni cause most of the time 
people want to be part of the pro of the product yes, yes. but they do not want to be part of the production mm -hmm. in making that product wakati usha usha blow usha ko celebrity everyone is like ah uli ni kijana wetu hata na kuona hapa hata namuonanga but when you are making that when you are in the struggles when you're looking for money for production no one gives a damn so maybe tell us how was your experience on that and how did you come to tackle it ni mwanzo unajua unajua mtaani kitu nafanya mtu asikukubali kwanza kitu ya kwanza mmezoeana watu wanakuonaga daily hata ukifanya ukisema wewe ni msanii mtu hezi hezi kuaminia lakini mtu wa nje ndio ataona uzuri wako ama aone talent yako eh mwanzo so kitu ilifanya sana sana mtu hezi kukubali ni ile labda wengine umesoma nao wengine kwanza sana sana mimi kitambo kwa watu mingi leo kora kora yeah yeah sasa ile mtu hezi kuamini ah tunaweza imba mm. eh sasa hiyo ndio ilikuwa challenge kubwa sana ile mm. mtu sasa kukubali mm -hmm. lakini sasa kubali juu tunaye kama events ni nini ni mm -hmm. tunataka vijana pamoja vitu kaizo sasa nimefanya wakakubali tu awesome eh, i see so. i see <laughs> maybe uh, talking about your music kidogo mm. umekuwa na challenges umekuwa na hizi vitu zote so far you're doing you're doing great mm -hmm. even you're on, on a tv platform right now yeah. <laughs> for an interview yeah, ukianza kuna zile inspirations ulikuwa unataka kuzimit then ukakamu kajua kuna challenges then ukakamu ka uka, 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 uka zile challenges mm. what do you think you did personally differently and yoku unafanya ukianza uli learn like in order for me to to get there to get my music out there i need to do one two three things differently oh kitulifanya kwanza ni kujikubali mm -hmm. mimi mwenyewe nilijikubali nikasema okay. i can do it na ile kufanya zoezi ku learn more about music mm -hmm. ku meet au ma celebrity at least nauliza niaje yule mimi naitwa dikene yeah. naweza tutaka kujua mtu anafanyaga aje ku make mm -hmm. pesa yani kutumia muziki Ani sijui ndio ndasema jani mtu anaweza make aje pesa kupitia muziki eh muziki inaweza eh yeah, yeah. sasa through hizo mm. vitu mm. kuuliza uliza mm. kufanya research nini nini yeah. ndio zilinifanya nika at least nika discover nikajua can do this yeah. eh nikajua naweza fanya muziki aina hii hivyo mm. na hivyo yeah through to research my best hivyo tu i see yeah okay mm. maybe for you prodi yes, uh, tell us uh, basically what what did you not know when you were starting that you currently know and uh, you are grateful that you know it right now okay kitu ya kwanza ambaye sikuwa najua when i was starting yeah uh, ya kwanza tulikuwa tunaanza tulikuwa tunafanya muziki kama hobby mhm mm while wengine wanafanya kama career yeah so hiyo uh, ndio ina differentiate uh, between uh, an artist who is going to be there for a long time mm -hmm. and an artist mwenye anapita tu na season na zin anapita tu mm -hmm. so wakati ilikuja gagundua how to turn music into to make it into be, to tap it as a business mm -hmm. that's when now nili settle kama kama artist kwa sababu ulifika mali you are so discouraged like i can i can i can just quit and let it go ni kwa msewa kawaida tu mtaani yeah. nifanye ni ile kufanya na shughuli zangu za kawaida mm -hmm. but nafika mahali go like uh, wakati unakutana na influential people kwanza sasa hii ndio kitu nasema uh, any uh, any upcoming artist they need mentors yeah, yeah. they need mentors na ukinialao kidogo abu kalins niongee kitu nataka mm -hmm. kuongea tu kitu kidogo tu okay. uh, ni kwamba uh, why, why why is uh, Tanzanian music doing so well okay. why is Ugandan music doing so well tell us because these people wale wale established artists wako na time ya kumenta those upcoming yeah. talent mm -hmm. wale in Kenya ni difference ya kwamba msanii mkubwa anakufa tu na jina yake mm -hmm. ana time ya kumenta mm -hmm. so there, there's no like hakuna uh, ile like your torch torch which is being passed on yeah. from this generation to this generation mm -hmm. that's what is hiyo uh, ndio kitu sasa mimi wakati nilijua kwamba i need to have mentors yeah. i connected i connected to people hiyo nimefanya kama mimi mwenyewe nilifanya okay. research yangu nika connect kwa watu wenye naweza enda kwao nikutane nao niwaambie yeye tafadhali nikitaka kufanya muziki nitafanyaje nikitaka yeah. kufanya hivi nitafanyaje yeah. so that was an, a personal effort but if uh, we want to make our music iweze compete with the tanzanian music mm. na ugandan hata rwanda wa karibu watakuja kutushinda kwa sababu we should, we should the, big artists should uh, have a session of mentoring yeah. the young artists like in a way of kupass torch 
That's why even the Western music is doing mm. so good. I see. Yes, sir. Maybe w why do you think the Kenyan industry is And why do you think bigger artists don't want to support smaller oh. artists? Okay, the, 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 the culture and culture the political system here too. Okay. Ambapo ya kwamba, the system vile tumelelewa ya kwamba, when a man has it, akonayo ni yake na ni yake, mm -hmm. na iyo yote ni yake. You see? Mm -hmm. So the, it's, the, it's a culture system ambayo tume grow from ambayo inatakana tuanze kuitoa with mm -hmm. this uh, democracy ambayo tunalilia ambayo iko katika nchi hii yeah. inatakana ianze kutoka hiyo kwa muziki ya kwamba don't take it uh, because I'm a big artist so because uh, I've, I've been able let's say like kama ni mimi nimehaswa kabisa nimejuana na abu mm -hmm. nimejuana na nani mm -hmm. I've, maybe I've used my effort to know you yeah, to yeah. know guys around here yeah. I go like so nataka pia huyo naye apitie hiyo shida mm -hmm. you see mm -hmm. why, why, why can't I maybe identify an, an, a talent na nikiona hii talent ina, inafaa the way na ni diamond alifanya kwa harmonize mm -hmm. nikiona hii talent inafaa i use my channel to bring this talent up. i see you see yeah, yeah. Uh, so and then that one utakuwa umesaidia na wewe mwenyewe unasaidia unamwambia pia wewe saidia mwingine yeah. i've done that you help another help another it will be a network of uh, vib vibrancy even hapa yeah. inaweza kuwa we can be kenya can be like west africa yeah. in terms of art i see yes sir I see. maybe to you um why do you think or what do you think is the biggest mistake most of the artists do? Okay. Mimi naweza sema hapo Kenya ni ile watu wanapen nini wasanii wanajitakiaga. Mhm. Mm Msanii anajitakia na ona huyu atanishinda, mm -hmm. nikisaidia huyu atakuja anishinde. Mm -hmm. Na hakuna competition hapo Kenya. Mimi sio ni sio mbona wanafanya gaivo. Hakuna competition hapo Kenya. But mtu anaona ati akikweka ngoma kwa channel mm -hmm. utakuja umshinde. Yeah, yeah. Yeye ndio anakuwa anga shida kubwa. That's why unaona hata celebrity haizi kusaidia. Kweli. Really? Eh, lakini Kenya inafaa pia tukue na umoja. Unajua umoja ni utafanya pia si muziki yetu isikike mm -hmm. to the world. True. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. inafaa tukue na umoja wasanii wa Kenya. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Na tuungane tungane si lenye kila mtu anajitakia kuna wasanii wametoka hata mta yetu but hezi kusaidia anaona tukimsai akikusaidia tutakuja kumshinda yeye ataona tu yeye mkali kumshinda sasa hiyo ndio inakuwa shida hapo Kenya tu hiyo ndio shida na unaona hapo nikiongezea kwa what uh, my friend has said okay. unapata kwamba hiyo 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 ina hiyo ina develop culture kwamba eh, nini unapata huyo msanii wakati anaenda anaenda like wakati huyo msanii amekuwa jina kubwa you know you cannot be jina kubwa all the time yeah, yeah. wakati umekuwa jina kubwa so you don't have a support system mm -hmm. you see you don't have a support system yeah, yeah. so unapata jina yako wakati inakuwa wiped na kwa wiped off kabisa there's, there's, you don't have like uh, wale wajukuu yeah. wako remember who msa alibleta revolution fulani mm -hmm. alisaidia msa fulani mm. yes i see mm -hmm. okay maybe talking about uh, this christmas eve Maybe I know you guys got your own plans. Yes. Maybe someone is uh, wants to drop a new track on the Christmas Eve. Plan yenu ya Christmas ni gani maybe? Mm. Wasani Chris you wana lalanga wana mka January ama they still do music. Eh hey, wa, wasani ukio okay, msani mazee usilale usilale yeah. uh, just uh, uh, put your time into practice. Mm -hmm. Wakati wengine wana wanajienjoy unless maybe umeenda show umeitwa show yeah. ambapo pia tutakuwa na show mm -hmm. I'll be having a show ambazo nitakuwa napiga hii Christmas yeah. unless umeitwa show lakini if uh, you're not in the show mm -hmm. try and uh, just uh, try and make your art kujinoa makali mm -hmm. saidi ya usani wako mm -hmm. yeah, so we'll be in the studio as usual yeah. doing our thing in fact on that Christmas day I won't be sleeping. I'll be in the studio making new beats, mm. making tracks. Mm. And uh, by the way, uh, unajua na collab na nini beat na producer Lil Wayne. Wow. Crazy. Mm. 808 Mafia Boss. Wow. Kim search kwa Instagram. Wow. Hata ukimuuliza Protobi ni nani, I'm uh. doing a collaboration with him. So, you know, nasema during Christmas, please don't don't, don't sleep. sleep yeah. uh, just uh, tafuta hizo ma connection fanya don't sleep don't awesome, sleep awesome. yes yes maybe for you dikin oh, mimi manze nini date 24 to christmas ndakuwa kitale yeah. kuna event iko huko mm -hmm. itakuwa noma sana watu wangu tupata na instagram nitaona kila kitu hapo yeah. itakuwa noma sana na message to, to watu wangu hapo watu wote nyo na wananiangalia pale yeah. naweza sema tu ikrisi kama unasikia kukunywa kunywa maji ama maziwa <laughs> Usikunye no drive manze tunakuhitaji sana nyinyi ndio watu wetu hapo mnatusupport msikunye yeah. msikunye TAE mm. kunywa maji kunywa maziwa na 
pia kesha kesha kumbukeni kesha mwanzetu tukue na amani na tushikilie amani sana hiyo ndio message to my people pale maybe before my the last word for you for the youths out there and also your fans and also mm. young guys trying to do music okay mi kwanza nikianza na young guys pale watu kama mimi naweza sema ukisikia unaweza fanya music kama unaweza fanya kitu usiluze hope fanya tu sisikize kitu watu wanasema fanya kitu yako inataka fanya kitu yako inataka hiyo ndio kitu mimi sema tunaendelea na kujituma na Mungu ataona bidii yako na ataendelea kufungua njia zako hiyo ndio kitu mimi sema usisikize story za watu ati oh you can't do it una sauti mbaya kwani nikuulize mwifana kwenje kwani ni wasanii wangapi unasikia sauti zao hata ziwezi hapa mm. kwa industry but wanafanya hmm? wanafanya tu so fanya kitu yako inataka na kila mtu atakukubali watu watawata ona bidii yako na watakukubali tu hiyo ndio tu kitu naweza sema awesome mm. maybe for you okay kwangu nezambia vijana you were not born a failure yeah kama generation yako imekuwa from a failing you are from a failing community you are not a failure you see you need to stand up work hard and be something be somebody in this country oh, i see okay so maybe uh, to kit kimalizia uh, i would like you to maybe for you to, to perform for us your track yeah your new latest track yeah. twa, 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 the video yeah. is coming soon that is the trending thing awesome. twa, twa, twa. But hey, le, uh, let me congratulate you guys you have incredible awesome videos man thank you thank yeah, you thank i love to stand at the quality thank you, awesome thank you. so maybe the flow is all yours yes perform for us that track you will also be performing for us that track and when we get back we will also be knowing about your social media handles yeah. as we sign off the show so yeah. starting with you pro toby ladies and gentlemen this is another one another one got it